Hey, what's up, you guys? Caboose XB. I'll bring you another Injustice 2 video. And today, what I got for you guys is some first looks that we got at Green Lantern and Scarecrow Super Move in Injustice 2 through the Injustice 2 mobile app. Now, before we get into the topic at hand, I wanted to ask you guys if we can get this video to 2,000 likes. I would really appreciate it if we can get this video to 2,000 likes. That would be awesome. With that out of the way, let's jump into the topic at hand about these Injustice 2 Super Moves in our first looks at Scarecrows and Green Lanterns. Now, these clips that I'm going to show you are coming from some people who aren't me. I didn't record any of these gameplays. So, the first one, the Green Lantern Super, is actually coming from the person who initially broke all this gameplay for the Injustice 2 mobile app, and that is All Stars Production. You can check out his channel in the link in the description box below. He's actually uploading a ton of content from the Injustice 2 mobile game, so if you'd like to see more content from this game and see some stuff behind the scenes, what these characters are like in the mobile app, you can definitely go subscribe to his channel. The second clip of the Scarecrow Super Move comes from someone on Twitter by the name of NeonYFY. He linked me in a tweet of him uploading the Scarecrow Super Move. So, with that said, check out these clips of the Green Lantern and Scarecrow Super Move, and we'll talk about them right after. That's right, holy crap, those super moves were pretty damn awesome. I gotta say, I liked Green Lanterns a lot more than I liked Scarecrows. Just the idea of it was so freaking cool. He straight up builds a giant mech suit construct and beats the crap out of you with it. It totally outdoes what his first super move was in Injustice Gods Among Us, and I can't wait to see what it's like on the console version. To be honest, that's what I feel for both of these super moves, because I feel like both of them just aren't done enough justice just seeing them on the mobile version of Injustice 2. I'm sure they're gonna look way cooler and you're gonna feel way more of a punch for every hit in these super moves when we see it on the console version. So that's what I'm holding out for, but just seeing them and getting an idea of what it's like, they, they both look really cool. I'm a big fan of Green Lanterns. It looks really freaking awesome. I'm excited to see what Scarecrows looks like in the console version because I wasn't incredibly impressed with it. I like the idea of it. It sticks with the theme of the character. He takes just like this fear toxin world. He's a giant. He's smashing you around. It is pretty cool, but it doesn't look the greatest just because it's the mobile version. You know, the boundaries can only be pushed so far with the mobile version. The graphics can only be so great. So I'm sure it's going to look a lot better on the console version for Injustice 2. Funny enough, breaking news, as this was being recorded, Neon YFY, who initially linked me the Scarecrow Super Move, just recently got footage of the Flash's Super Move. So I'm going to show it to you here. Big shout outs to Neon YFY. If you want to check out his Twitter, it's going to be linked in the description. You can follow him because it looks like he's trying to record more and more Super Moves from the Injustice Mobile app. So you can head to his Twitter page. It's going to be linked in the description. But here is the Flash's Super Move right now. Yeah, holy crap, that was so freaking awesome. He uses like this mirrored version of himself to help beat the crap out of his opponent. He's running in circles, punching you left and right. I thought it looked really freaking cool. And honestly, it looks so good for the mobile version. I can only expect that it's going to look even better if we get to see it on the console version. So shout out to Neon YFY for linking me that. Thank you so much, dude. But with all that said, we got one more super move that we got a first look at. And this is actually coming from Reddit from the username Happy Troll SFM. Now, this super move we only got some images of, unfortunately, and that is for Cyborg Super Move. So, we got a first look here through these images, and it's really hard to tell what's going on, but I wanted to show you guys just to give you guys an idea on what his super move could be like. Maybe he opens some sort of boom tube here. It seems like he takes you to Apocalypse. You can see some parademons in some of these images. I'm not entirely sure what's going on, where the damage is being dealt, but... It does look very interesting, and I'm very excited to see what the super move ends up looking like. But with all that said, let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. Which super move of the ones you just saw in this video are your favorites so far? I want to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. Once again, if we can get this video to 2,000 likes, that would be awesome. I'm Caboose XBL. You can click on screen to make your way to one of the other videos on the channel, or you can click my logo to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Please 
Follow me on Instagram and Twitter and like me on Facebook. Those links are in the description. Drop a like if you enjoyed. Leave a comment if you have an opinion. And subscribe if you're new. See you guys later.